WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finish up 74, NASDAQ down 125, S&P's off 7.5, gold contract. Cut the bid out here today up 13.20, 17.95. Silver also up 23 cents, $24.40. They were a lot higher until Powell, Powell come out and sounded a note about his concern about higher inflation. It's just going to, uh, he's just trying to figure out how to say it, folks. We all know inflation is raging out here, okay? That being said, though, guess what? With inflation raging, Gold is going to be raging also. Why? Because the bottom line is that gold catches up with everything, okay? No matter how many times they want to hammer it, the bottom line, if we have higher inflation, we're going to have higher gold. That's the bottom line. Oil. Check this out, man. Uh, oil up $1.44, $83.94 a barrel. Lights, uh, notes and bonds. Yeah, the 10-year up 8 ticks. Trading at 130.13, the 30 year up 26 ticks at 158.18 in King Dollar. King Dollar down 163 ticks, trading out at 93.607. King Dollar now is in the lower trading range. Bottom line, if we get some follow through, we haven't. King Dollar's gone to the lower trading range three times this week. It saved itself twice. It closed the week out in the lower trading range. If King Dollar gets some follow through, and I take his King Dollar wants to go to 89. If we start seeing that happen, you are going to get about 2,500 in gold, folks. It's going to be a big number. The euro is at 116, the yen's at 113.44, and the British pound is at 137 to 1 US dollar. We get over and we take a look at the SPY, what you're looking at inside the SPY first. Um, it, the SPY hit and failed at its highs, okay? 450.405 was the high that was taken out. Bottom line, you get to 454.67, closed at 453.22. What happened there, though, is that you did not have the contraction of volume. You actually got an expansion of volume. So that's saying that the SPY can basically test the highs once again. Here's the divergence. Not the NDX 100, nor the Qs. The Qs went to lower price, down $3.17, had a big expansion of volume. We did 34 million shares after yesterday reaching highs at 25 million. That wants lower price. We'll see how this shakes out. There's going to be lots of tech stocks out next week. It's going to be kind of a field day. Have a great weekend, folks. Have a safe weekend. Come back and visit Tommy Monday morning, 9 o'clock, kicks us off. Great show. Have a great one, folks.